In this video, I'm going to go over how to update the pricing database in the drywall plugin for 9.0. Click on your list tab and you'll see DP pricing file here, expand this, and now you'll see all of the folders for all of the material that's in the drywall plugin. Here's where you're going to go to change my prices to your prices. You want to click on a folder, it opens up, and you come through here and you change the quarter inch high flex your, to your price. Click enter and it saves it. Click on another one. Change the price. Click on it. It saves it. Now once you change the price, you want to remember the last time you updated that price. Under the last update here, just click into this cell. The drop down window opens up a calendar. Click today's date. And this will let you know the last time you updated this part. Now this is the master price list, so every time you drop in a part, this is the price it's going to charge. Now I would go through here and I would change only the parts that I use a lot of. I wouldn't go through and try to change all of the parts. You can see the ones that I just have numbers, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11. I don't use these studs, so I didn't put no prices in there. I only did the ones that I use a lot and these are all of the prices um, for the parts that I use and you want to change these prices to your prices. It's the same way for every part and this is the master price list database for the drywall plugin and that concludes this video.